guys, I am Flight Attendant Jojo. Thank you so much, Princess Polly. I am going on a spring break trip. Spring break is, it is happening. I'm having all the families, all the little kids, all the college stage kids on my flight. I am so excited. I got to do a $500 shopping haul with Princess Polly. So thank you so much, Princess Polly, for sponsoring this video. You guys know I am traveling all the time. And before any big trip, I do like to do a mini haul, but this one was like over the top. Can't believe it. We certainly splurged. I got so excited when Princess Polly reached out because they are Australian and my husband's Australian. I was in Australia when they reached out. I was beyond excited, but they do ship from the US and free expedited shipping. And that will take about three to four days if you spend over 50 US dollars. They also offer shop pay and after pay for all US customers. Princess Polly gave us a promo code. That's this and it will also be linked below. Let's just start with what I'm wearing right now because I have not been able to take this off since I got it. It is just a one shoulder crop top. It singes right here. I'll also let you know all the sizes. I've never shopped with Princess Polly, so if this is your first time, like I do find that they were very true to size on every single thing. I got a four, and for reference, in the US, I'm typically a small, occasionally a six. This top, the color was unreal and it fits so well. I, I pretty much haven't taken it off since getting it. This is one of my favorites, but I will be saving best for last. But I do really like this crop top because it can be dressed up and dressed down so easily. And the quality is unreal. They had a few colors of this top, but for spring and like it doesn't get too close to your armpits where you worry about like sweat marks or something, it doesn't do that. I don't even need a bra with it, so don't worry about like trying to find a one strap bra or I guess strapless, but honestly I feel like it just covers well enough and, is, and has a thick enough fabric that you don't need it. It also goes really tight at the waist, so it's not loose. Next, I think I have my biggest travel go-to is this cropped blazer. The fabric is so insanely nice. It is thick and soft. It's a really good springtime option. What I really envisioned with this top is wearing it with some jeans and having it as a loose crop top. You could easily go no bra and it has that really deep V effects that you're gonna wanna show off. My intention with it is to let the deep V really show and I got it in a size four. I thought I was going to maybe do a six, but I'm really glad that I didn't and I stuck with the four because it is oversized. It has shoulder pads, be warned. That's the whole point is still big baggy oversized everything. I got the black skirt to match with it because I want sets. Like anytime I can do a travel set, that's probably my favorite. It is a size four also. It's linen. I do not have a black linen skirt. I love how versatile it is. Everyone who likes to wear skirts should have a black skirt in their suitcase because I just think it's one of those staple pieces you can never not travel with. Okay, next, I kind of went a bit wild. Can you tell I have a one shoulder thing going on right now for spring? But I love dresses because you just throw them in your suitcase and you go. People always ask, what are some travel hacks? And dresses are the travel hack. The dress is a bit see-through, so be careful. You probably couldn't get away with any undergarments unless they are nude. I like it because it's tight enough and it's giving my body a good shape. When it comes to spring, I'm really trying to go more towards brighter colors or white. That was the only black in my haul apart from one other thing. If I need something to go from day to night, this is gonna be my go-to because I can put a jacket on it and dress it down or I can just leave bare shoulders out and I feel like it's a bit more dressed up. I could easily wear it with heels or sandals or even sneakers. Like 
this dress is probably one of the most versatile things that I'll have in my collection. When I mentioned putting on a jacket to take away from that dress just being like a bodycon dress, this is the jacket I imagined. Also, that dress was in a size 4. Everything in my haul is a size 4. There were things maybe I could go to a 6, but I'll let you know. This was not something I would have gone to a 6 for. It is a 4. And oh my gosh, this jacket is just it. I think springtime is when the leather jackets come out. Fault me, I don't care. If you think it's fall or winter, I think leather jackets are for spring because if it's gonna rain spontaneously, I want it to just drip right off of my outfit. And that's why I love leather jackets. The oversized thing is my thing. And leather jackets can be hot, but I feel like spring weather just changes so quickly that you could go from needing to have a one shoulder deal and then going to like, okay, it just dropped 10 degrees, let me put on a jacket. I love this one because it is so big, oversized, what all the young kids, you know, are wearing, but also it's cropped and it really does singe in at the waist. When you're gonna pack a jacket in your wardrobe, like this is definitely gonna be it. Or if you're gonna get cold on the plane, like I always do, I'm just gonna have this on whenever I'm going through the airport. <laughs> black like leathery things can smell really weird when you get them but this no smell to it so don't worry about that quality of leather like i own a few leather jackets i'm very particular about faux leather and this one is definitely one of the best ones i own i don't think this would be a spring trendy haul if it, I didn't buy a colorful set. So this is it. This is the top. <laughs> and then there's some pants with it. They are trouser pants and they are unreal. They look so good. I, I'm shocked. They actually looked good on my butt and that never happens with trousers. Again, this is size four and I probably could have sized up. Like this is one of those things that Maybe I could have done a six. They had a lot of colors in this set, so I would even consider getting more colors. Lilac, and it's not like an obnoxious purple. Like It's a very subtle purple, and it's beautiful, and it feels good. Like It holds you in and stuff like that, but the fabric's soft enough that it's going to show lines through it. I'll show you. Like, I'm not just trying to travel around in a bra. Like, this would easily be a really nice airport outfit. Or even if I layered a button-down shirt on top of it and had the cropped bra showing through, that'd be nice. Forewarning, I am not tall and I don't have a long torso. This made my torso look so long. So if you are short, this might be your jam. My waist is not like a little snatch waist. Like your girl just doesn't have a tiny waist. So the trousers were tight. So I'm gonna have to move the button and loosen it up a little bit. Or in this video, I just took a safety pin. I didn't actually button the pants. I just safety pinned it closed, but I liked the way it was fitting on my butt so I didn't want to size up. Like, I really liked the tight look, but I probably could have gone for a six and then maybe buttoned the pants. <laughs> but I just really liked the four and I'm, I'm gonna stick with the four and just move the button closure. We're getting to the end. If you're not subscribed to my channel, make sure you subscribe so that you can see all these pieces on my trips when we go travel to India and to Barcelona. I'm absolutely dying over this dress. It is a midi dress and it is sage. No mini dress has ever complimented my body as much as this one and bodycon. Like I get really nervous if I wear any bodycon anything and the things in this haul have just, just done it for my body and I'm really happy about it. You could disagree, but don't leave it in the comments. Whether you're on the big chested side or little like me, like you can either pull this top up and it will cover completely or you can pull it down and I'm probably gonna pull it down and kind of give myself that push-up look and it is thick enough that I am certainly not wearing a bra because the back part of this is un 
real. It's not see-through. Some pieces have been a little bit sheer and this is not one of them. And the length is really great because being short and trying to find a midi dress is really hard because sometimes they're just like full long dresses. Tell me what your favorite item so far has been and that dress was for. Lastly, oh who is always just like looking for a sexy white button down. And this isn't just a shirt, it is a dress. Oh, I can't wait to wear this out or to even wear it to the pool. This is see-through, again. That's why it'd be a really nice pool cover-up. It is a perfect length where it's not too short, where you're thinking it's a t-shirt. Like, it does look like a dress. I got in a size four. Maybe you could size up, but I don't want it to look too oversized where I just threw on some man's white t-shirt. I also got these white sandals. Shoes are certainly having their platform moment. Feeling a little bit like a brat in them. Had to figure out how to walk in them for a second because they are really oversized. The eight fit my foot. So I am always an eight in heels, eight and a half in like some tennis shoes, but the eight fit perfectly. But I can't wait for spring and just to wear white shoes all the time like i am a white shoe kind of girl so the white sandals needed to be added to my closet i think that they're enough of a statement that you could wear it with all of these pieces sometimes it's like oh heels whatever I think they're a statement and you could easily wear them out to dinner but they're also that casual look you could certainly get away with them at the pool i hope you noticed the unreal purse in most of those shots i love my purses and this one was just so cute so it has that dingly gold strap that is just the it thing right now and then the crossbody so if you want to you could also take all the straps off and just have it as a cute little handle purse spring and white and the croc leather and it's really great quality like I cannot wait to be traveling in India with this purse it is gonna look so cute and it is such a statement to all the outfits like just the cutest thing so i think it would fit like a phone a passport some lip gloss and maybe one other thing it's not the biggest but that's the thing is mini right so i don't know if you noticed it i got this really cute necklace it has a sun on it and it also it came with this second part to it every year i have this tendency of just getting a new pair of sunglasses there's a designer pair of sunglasses that look just like this on the side. I was really excited when I saw that it had this V moment going on. My mom wore them while she was here this weekend and she looked so cute in them. I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog as much as I enjoyed doing all the shopping, when I'm gonna go and travel in all these clothes, and I can't wait to see you in the next video. See you guys later. Bye!